gets around Finney Smith, has a layup right here. So, yeah. no, I'm going to give an ooh and an ah to the crowd. <laughs> right now, one hand high pickup. So this is a elite finish and it's very manipulative. So for the drill sake, we're going to start and we're going to go off a stationary position, not use the basket yet. So all I want you to do, depending on how much space you have, I'm going to step a little bit outside the paint and I'm going to drive at the paint with two dribbles. And all I'm going to focus on is be able to pick the basketball up here over my head as I sprint. I'll release it, turn around and go again. Glass. Yes. Look at his concentration. Horford comes over. Wow. Master of the body control, the master of the spin. If you are working on this drill and you keep losing the ball, it just means you don't have enough control as you, as you come up. Now, I don't have big hands and I, don't I can't palm the basketball, especially off the dribble. So if I'm able to get here and work on the pickup, it's just me absorbing the basketball. Defense makes a mistake. It just opens up the driving lane for Russ, who makes a pretty finish. Tatum comes over just a little bit too late right there. West so again, we're attacking. We'll pick up, get the ball above our head, turn around, and then we'll go left hand with it. Notice I'm taking a little harder dribble with it and I'm turning my wrist quickly. <laughs> Under the ball. Two hand high pickup. Now this is a great pickup. One of the reasons is because it gets you super skinny. All right, and obviously your defender's hands when you get into pickups are around your frame. A hard jam and a foul. Those long strides. And look at this, you got three white jerseys trying to stop the ball and they can't. Kevin Durant's finish. At the end. He covers a lot of ground. There it is. So again, off the second dribble, your focus is the gather and getting the ball up as high as you can and then getting into any finish that you want. We're focusing on getting skinny at the rim. Let's get it. All right, two and high pick up again off that second bounce. You're going over the top with two hands. So you pick it up, you'll go over the top, stay skinny, get into your finish. You, if you want to at home, remember, you can mix it up. You can take three dribbles, you can take one, it's up to you. The focus right now is the pickup, high pickup, two hands. Gets around Finney Smith, has a layup right here. So, like, yeah. oh, I'm gonna give an ooh and an ah to the crowd. Goes up. So, now we're gonna focus on going from one hand to two hands. Typically, in the game, and, you, and you'll see in, the, in the, some of the NBA footage, when you're driving, you pick up with two. If you have an active defender, sometimes you might have to come back over the top. Gets around Finney Smith, has a layup right here. Say, like, yeah. no, I'm going to give an ooh and an ah to the crowd. Goes up. This is one on the Grizzly. First, he, he fakes the dribble with the reverse spin. So right now, it's a little more advanced. You're just going to step inside the elbow. You'll take a bounce left foot, right hand. Go right to two hands. Go high. And then you could jump right, right, or take another step with the left. Let's take a look at it. <laughs> Now be careful with this, that you don't really kill it too early on that left foot and then be slow into that transition because they'll call a travel even though it's not because you're in a game you'll be moving. So this is the breakdown of it. Same thing here, we'll just step right, left, right, two, one, and now I can jump or I can take another step with that right. <laughs> 